This was a long road, to be honest with you. We tried a lot of different things. We wanted to focus on performance and training. This is what our core value is, performance, and how we can innovate and design and develop shoes, apparel, accessories. We saw a need where a heavy weightlifting was using a certain type of shoe. And we also saw the CrossFit, you know, where they're using some sort of agile, uh, flexible training shoe. But the challenge is the athlete would use two different shoes. They would switch them out. What we did was combine that together. This was the first 3D printed training launch to market. We allowed two interlace structures within each other and they had a nice built-in cam motion so it actually allowed for energy return, which was really fascinating. I'm passionate about making things go from a napkin sketch to a product on the shelf. The architect actually was inspired by two things, man-made objects and natural organic shapes. With 3D printing, we could really innovate the future of footwear technology. The general design plays a crucial role in the design process to create lightweight structures and reduce weights and parts. There's a lot of opportunity for that. We were able to try out numerous patterns and numerous spacing of the structures to allow us to test and validate. It really comes down to a correlation between simulation and mechanical testing. We had over 80 athletes wear the shoe and test it. We had over 120 hours just in the gym. This is our first 3D printed shoe. We've created a compelling performance training shoe. We hit that athlete and make them perform that much better.